Hi there. Good afternoon. I'm Sheila Maria and I hear angels and spirit guides. It's really, really lovely to be with you this afternoon and I thought I'd just record a short message for the weekend. Archangel Michael's with all of us very strongly right now and he's really wanting to talk to you about the life you've had versus the life that you're creating. And he wants you to know that 215 is what we call a destiny year. And this means that the scope is there for you to experience and expand in so many more ways than you can even imagine. Many of you are undergoing shifts right now. We finish with the retrograde tomorrow. You may have had situations, maybe in a short illness, um, renegotiations needed in relationships, or a feeling of increased dissatisfaction in your jobs. Your priorities are shifting and they're coming closer to home. Some of us are feeling the urge to get more involved in magic and to see this working in our lives and then sharing this with the lives of others. Others are working on a more individual basis and we are wondering how, we're even asking the question, how can we make these things happen? So 215 is a destiny year, but it doesn't start in January. It's actually starting now, today. It's starting November, and this is really all about you resolving to take the action that is going to allow magic to come in. So if you want to win the lottery, play the lottery. If you want to develop your spiritual gifts, develop your spiritual gifts. If you want a new job, start looking for a new job. Start brushing up on your skills. But more than that, it's closing the gap between you and the unseen world. And the unseen world is uh, the real world, as far as I'm concerned. And the unseen world, you can produce or create anything just like that. So we're always wanting that experience in our physical lives. And the angels are saying, the more that you get quiet, the more that you connect with the unseen, the more your ability to create in this world, in this physical 3D world, is actually going to come forth. And this happens because you're in communion with your soul, okay? Your soul lives in the same realm as the archangels and your soul is always beaming at you information and guidance and downloads of frequency. You're also catching the eye of masters, other souls that want to work with you and they are also giving you upgrades in your abilities and your awareness. So even the fact that you're listening to this video is because your awareness is expanding and you're asking the questions, how can I do this? How can I shift from where I am to where I want to be? So start connecting with the unseen world. Take some time and connect with the angelic realms. Connect with the guided realms, your own guides. A wonderful way to start this would be to join me for a webinar that I'm running, which is Friday 28th of November. It's called Meet Your Guide. And you're going to meet your guide, enjoy a meditation, an opportunity for you to receive guidance from your guide through me. Uh, we're going to be doing some oracle card work. And we're also going to be talking about requesting new guides to help you with those real world experiences such as money, jobs, relationship, children, whatever. So we're going to get you the help that you need going forward into your destiny year of 215. Start connecting with the magic that's all around you. Start today. Your ability to connect is as great as anyone's. And if you need some help in recognizing your ability, come over to my website. I love to hear from you, www.channeledreadingswithsheila.co.uk. You'll find I offer courses to help you develop your ability to connect with angels and guides. I'm also running a light working business course, which is for you to energetically and practically and real time 
create and run your own business. And we're going to be connecting with your magic in order to make this a reality, not just a dream. Dreams are wonderful, but we want goals here. Archangel Michael's asking you to remember your true magic. Accept it, connect to it, and see your life blossom. It's wonderful to be with you. I hope you have a really beautiful weekend and an even more magical now. Goodbye for now.